I liked Tony Shalhoub's jacket. <laughs> Do you think I've gotten stranger? Email me at I don't give a rat's ass dot com. <laughs> Uh, my next guest, you might know from her from the Friday Night Lights show, and she's in a, a new film, 500 Days of Summer, which is in theatres now. Please welcome the lovely Minka Kelly, everybody. Minka Kelly. <laughs> You look lovely. You've got the lovely... That's Kelly Green. It is. Yeah, it's it a is. lovely dress you're wearing. Well, Are you Irish? You. I have a little Irish in me. I do, yeah. Yes. Yeah, so yeah. Well, your name's Kelly. Yes. Yeah, and, and Minka, that's not so Irish? No, no, my mom just made it up. She just made it up? Yeah. She just made up a name? She just made it up. I, I know. Love I, that. I should come up with some sort of interesting story, but... No, 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 no. Up. Here, it would look out of place. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're talking about... Oh, well, never mind. Where are you from, then? I was, I was born here, and, um... Here? That's quite an interesting mug. You were born right here? No, no, I just, I, I'm sorry, I couldn't help but notice this mug. What, the cup there? Yeah, yeah, that's from Albuquerque, that cup oh. right there, Albuquerque <laughs> Rattlesnake Museum. Oh, okay, yes, and I spent eight years of my life in Albuquerque. At the museum? There you go. No, not at the museum. <laughs> Have you been? Have you been to uh, the Albuquerque Museum? I Rattlesnake have not museum? even heard of the Rattlesnake Museum. No. Then you weren't in Albuquerque. <laughs> no. Okay. Uh, what were you doing in, in, in Albuquerque then, if you weren't going to see the <laughs> snakes? When you're a kid, you can't really choose where you live. Oh, so yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. Well, there's that. Sort of mom's decision as opposed well, to well, Albuquerque was her choice. Was your mom yeah. big on snakes? Did she? Can't say that she was. No. And I wouldn't have chosen that particular town. <laughs> and and your, uh, your, your, uh, your dad is a musician, yes? Yes, he is. What does he do? He plays guitar. In which rock pop group? Uh, he's not in a group anymore. He oh, used he's not? to be, yeah. What, what did he used to be in? Uh, <laughs> he was in a band called Aerosmith. Aerosmith. Oh. Oh. What are you doing at? <laughs> really? Very long time ago? Very long time yeah. ago, yeah. Does he play the guitar now? He does. When he watches TV, kind of hangs out, plays. Listen, does he watch TV wearing a, a sort of, um, you know, a, a shirt and shorts with yeah. uh, the guitar on his lap and a cigar? How do you know? I, I think I know him. Ah. <laughs> Amazing. Is your, so your dad's Irish, then? No, he's French. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> does he understand our, our ways in America? Uh, he does. <laughs> He's American, but he was born in France. Really? Which part of France? Paris. France. Really? Have you been to Paris? Not yet. Really? Really. What the hell is wrong with I you? Know. You spent eight years in Albuquerque, you don't even spend a weekend in France? Albuquerque wasn't my choice. As soon as I had the, the choice, I, I got out of there. I came right wait, 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 wait. You never got out of there. You still haven't been to Paris. You I have know. to go to Paris. Where have you been then? It's, it's definitely Other than Albuquerque, which is a nice town. Um, I just got back from Africa. Africa? Yeah. There, now you're talking. Where yeah. were you in Africa? I was in Ethiopia and Kenya. What were you doing there? I went with a really wonderful organization called the Mocha Club, who shows how you can have such a huge impact on the cost of just a couple of mochas, or $7. Like, for example, you can, uh, with $7, give water to seven African... Mm, sorry, I'm a little sorry, nervous. Sorry, do you want to switch? Have, have some water. There, yeah, yeah. Seven no, no, don't drink that. There, there are that cup over there. <laughs> You can't drink out of this cup. <laughs> Only Americans drink out of this cup. <laughs> you all right? Are you all right? Do you get nervous on talk shows? I'm sorry, I'm a little nervous. Really? I don't know if it's you or the show or the cup. No, I'm so, Look, look, look. <laughs> First of all, let me assure you, <laughs> it, this is not a very important show. No, not that. I and, knew that. And, I and, did and, know that. And your career... <laughs> That's the kind of thing we do here. Yes, we make good. a fool of the funny foreigner. Yes, That's no, he was calling you very, he said that you've gotten more and more weird. Who, Tony? Yes, and I, I wonder if that, I heard a, about a puppet collection you had, I wonder if that might have had to do with... I don't have a puppet collection. No. I just don't have any friends. <laughs> I'm almost 50 years old. I'm 47 years old. Do you huh? believe it? Well, don't answer huh. this, but yes, 47. <laughs> I know, 47, good lord. That's 
pretty up there. It yeah. is. It's get. You know what? I start. I start going like this with my pants. I'm like this. Okay. And I go. <laughs> and I tell you what else. I've started to do this. I, when, I've just noticed when I'm on my own, which is a lot, just me and my puppets. I sometimes when I'm on my own, I do this. Oh, yeah. The old man teeth licking stuff. Yeah. You know. Definitely over the hill. Sorry if I'm turning you on. <laughs> <laughs> so the uh, what's the film about then? Oh, it's it's really a lovely film. Five Hundred Days of Summer is probably one of the best movies I've seen in a long time, and I have so little to do with that. I I really have such a small part in the movie, and I'm I couldn't be more proud to be a part of something so wonderful. It's Joseph Gordon-Levitt and Zoe Deschanel have the most wonderful chemistry I've seen in a very long time. So it's about a chemist. And it's not about a chemist. Sorry, I'll answer the question. I'll answer the question. Does um, he? Uh, <laughs> does he? Does the chemist create a formula and then? <laughs> And then go nuts yes, and wreck it's a movie the joint. About chemistry. <laughs> I think probably he, this is my idea for a film. A chemist goes nuts and wrecks the joint. Oh, sort of like Nutty Professor. Like no, 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 not like the Nutty no. Professor. No. The original Nutty Professor. No. No. Okay. No. Look, I'm it's sorry. my film. I'm sorry. And, uh, no, he goes nuts and wrecks the joint, but seriously in a dramatic way, not in a funny Eddie Murphy way. No. No, and I kind of. This could be the end. And then the, and then the guys that have to come from the government go, ready the jet. And, and the guy who's the detective trying to find them goes, we're through the looking glass here, people. That's what you want in a film. Does anyone in your film say, we're through the looking glass here, people? Then I won't be seeing it. <laughs> I will. What's it about? It's a lovely film about love. It's, it's sort of, it's, it is about love it's it's a sort of backwards romantic comedy it's not your average romantic comedy whereas it's not where the girl is hopelessly in love and looking for prince charming it's the girl who actually doesn't really believe in it until it actually happens to her and the guy is hopelessly in love with her it's a documentary then i'm not yeah. making <laughs> It sounds lovely. I'm sorry we don't have more time to talk about it. It's lovely to see Minka Kelly, everybody. We'll be right back.